Na operation ya kuboresha usajili wa watoto wasichana katika shule ni kaunti ya Garissa imezinduliwa. Takwimu kutoka uh, Wizara ya Elimu zinaonyesha kuwa kiwango cha mimba za utotoni miongoni mwa wasichana wenye umri wa kati ya miaka kumi na kumi na tisa kaunti ya Garissa ni asilimia kumi na saba huku idadi ya wanaojiunga na shule ikisalia kwa asilimia sitini ikilinganishwa na wavulana ambao ni asilimia tisini. Mwanabari wetu Alice Diana na taarifa hiyo kwa kina. Idadi kubwa ya wasichana wadogo wakati ya umri wa miaka kumi na kumi na tisa wanaopata mimba katika kaunti ya Garissa imebua wasiwasi katika kaunti hiyo jambo ambalo limefanya jukwaa la wanawake wa Afrika ambao ni wataalamu wa elimu fawe kwa ushirikiano na wakfu wa Mastercard shirika la afya duniani WHO na msalaba mwekundu kuanzisha operesheni ya kuongeza usajili wa wasichana katika shule Mpango huo ambao unatekelezwa katika kaunti zingine 19 unanuia kutoa hatua ambazo zinalenga kushughulikia changamoto za elimu ya mtoto msichana na kuongeza usajili wao shuleni. <tos> Naomi Kimadhi kutoka Fawe anasema idadi ya wasichana walio nje ya shule inatia wasiwasi jambo ambalo anasema linapaswa kuwatia wasiwasi wadau wote. From our deliberation today uh, it is clear that the issue of teenage pregnancy is really rampant in Garissa but so is the issue of child marriage as most of the girls who become uh, pregnant between the ages of 10 19 Uh, end up being married off early. We are hoping that through our interventions we can see a significant reduction in this. Our interventions will be focused on community sensitization. We will also be working with the schools to strengthen systems and through our Tuseme clubs to see that the students have a safe place to vo voice their challenges and create open dialogue between them and the teachers so that they are able to be supported in good time. Kando na mimba za utotoni, umaskini na ndoa za mapema zinazosababisha wasichana kuacha shule au kutoenda shuleni, ukame uliokidhiri pia umetajwa kuchangia pakubwa katika idadi ndogo ya wasichana shuleni kwani wazazi wanaendelea kutembea na familia zao na mifugo yao kutafuta maji na malisho na hivyo kuathiri elimu ya watoto wao. Kwa ile kitu inatusumbua sisi ni janga hii ya ukame ambaye iko upande hii yetu. Maeneo yote subcounty tisa yote mvua haijanyesha wanafunzi kuenda shule ni ngumu sababu ya kukosa chakula unaweza kuwa mtoto hata ametoka nyumbani bila breakfast lunch na saba ninge omba governor yetu nadhif jama wa garissa ajaribu kufanya school feeding program dr korio hussein mkurugenzi wa elimu katika kaunti ya garissa anasema kuna haja ya juhudi za pamoja kurekebisha hali hii ya wasichana kutoenda shuleni kwa upande wake sheikh hassan abdi Alisema viongozi wa dini watatumia vipindi vya mazungumzo ya redio na baraza kufikisha ujumbe kwa wananchi akisema kwamba wanawake ndio msingi wa familia. We are now sensitizing our stakeholders so that one day they should know that uh, a girl has a big role in our education system in our society. Viongozi hao pia wameitaka serikali kuandika walimu zaidi katika shule za mkoa huo na kuwasaidia watoto wanaotoka katika mazingira duni wakisema ukosefu wa walimu pia umewakatisha tamaa wanafunzi kwenda shule. Na pia serikali tuna tunaomba wasichana ambaye wamebata hiyo maafa na shida hiyo watafute pinu ya kusoma. Wasizuie walimu wasivuguze wasiseme hiyo msichana bingine akona mimba mwalimu anafuguza hiyo sisi kama viongozi tunabinga Alice Diana Dira ya Hope TV